Canada Talks. Better than all the rest, better than anyone, anyone I've ever met. And I'm stuck on your heart, I hang on every word you say, but tear us apart. Baby, I would rather be dead. In your heart, I see the start of every night and every day. Now, back to The Breakdown with Allison Door, Canada eyes, Talks, Sirius XM 167. We all collectively lost our minds when we heard this version of Simply the Best, arranged and performed by our next guest, uh, who is so multi-talented and, of course, uh, performed this song as Patrick on Schitt's Creek and uh, went from there to Broadway and, of course, has been acting his whole life. And now... You get to sleep with him. Oh. Hold on, Cassandra, oh. calm down. Saucy. Oh my goodness. He is the narrator of the latest installment of the hugely popular Audible series. This one is Sleep Sound with Noah Reed. Joining Cassandra and I now, welcome back to the show, Noah Reed. How are you? <laughs> I'm good. How are you guys? Well, we're doing pretty good. Uh, better now for hearing your voice and excited that we get to hear more of it. Well, yeah, this one is, um, is, is a, was a super interesting, uh, came to me at a really interesting time at a time when probably I'm, I value sleep more than ever before. Uh, as, a, as a new dad, I'm kind of like, you know, trying to catch a, a Z or two wherever I can. So I, I, uh, I, I really thought that this was kind of like, uh, serendipitous timing. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to use this resource because it's probably a bit weird to listen to your own soothing <laughs> yeah. tones as you try to fall yeah. asleep. But yeah, mm-hmm. um, but yeah, I need to get into the uh, into the other uh, Audible sleep cast because uh, this is you know <laughs> this was a, a fun thing to do. Well, and yeah, I don't I don't know about you, but I personally hate listening back to my own voice. So I want <laughs> yeah, I want you to talk me to sleep i don't want me to do it mm-hmm. well you know lucky for you now now you can and i'll i'll say this about this this project it's it was um the the least interesting part of it is my part of it like the the part of it that i got got really excited about was the field recordings of this there's six episodes and they all center around like a field recording of like a wintry soundscape and the soundscapes are so unique and they're like, you know, an example is like uh, an abandoned ski lift on a mountain in Bolivia and the wind is howling through one of the poles left over. And it's got this crazy like harmonic tone to it and it just keeps like shifting and changing. And I found it really uh, pretty like ethereal and amazing to listen to. And so basically through the six episodes, I introduce the sort of the landscape and what you're hearing. And then the the soundscape plays out as you sort of like drift off to sleep. And um, so, yeah, there were some pretty amazing uh, uh, sort of visual paintings that uh, that came through in the writing. And then the sounds themselves are, are really enthralling. So I'm excited for people to get to listen to this. It's so fascinating because, yeah, I think in general, we don't necessarily notice kind of the noise that goes on around you. And then when you listen to these, it's like, yeah, it would not occur to me. Hey, you know what a great sound is? Let's go to Bolivia. Mm-hmm. And let's get a, <laughs> find an abandoned ski resort. Like it's, yeah. but yet it's like, yeah, this is a, a soothing sound. And well, the, I, who thought and, of that? Yeah, particularly in the winter, I think there are all these kind of like really interesting winter soundscapes. And like, there's nothing better than being cozy when it's cold outside. Mm. And, you know, some of these kind of like things that bring the the outdoor winter into your into your headspace, uh, knowing that you're kind of like, you know, warm under the covers like that's a that's mm. a kind of a nice feeling, you know, to hear the crunch of a snow or the, the thaw of a, of a springtime forest. And, you know, it's just a, it's just a really cool idea. Um, and so I was excited to be a part of it. I love it. It's true. Yeah. When you're cold. 
outside. All you want to do is just be cozy and have that imagery. Um, I know when you were younger, you loved falling asleep to like the sounds of water and bodies of water. What helps you sleep now if you're not able to listen to yourself, your own voice? How do you kind of settle into sleep? Oh, man. Well, you know, right now we, we're, we're listening to a lot of those like rumbly white noise uh, sounds because, uh, you know, the, the baby seems to like them. So, mm-hmm. you know, that there's a lot of that. Um, but yeah, I mean, you're right. As a kid, I had like, I, I were, when I was like eight years old, I was doing a production of Beauty and the Beast uh, in downtown Toronto. And on two show days, I'd have to like have a nap between the shows. And uh, my parents had this like CD of like underwater whale sounds. And it was kind of hilarious, but it was super soothing. And it was kind of the only way I could like totally knock out in between shows. So you know, there is that kind of um, it, the the, uh, the the senses are, you know, really can can help you get down. And, and I'm seeing that sort of firsthand as a dad. Now it's really uh, it's kind of amazing what works and what doesn't work. Um, and it's so personalized. Right. It has so much to do with, like, you know, what what sounds you've heard growing up and, and what what sort of taps into that relaxation thing that we all kind of need from time to time. You know, we talk a lot about sleep on this show because uh, Cassandra and I love it. We do a lot of it. <laughs> we we, it. we worry a lot about our guests because uh, often we're talking to very busy people. And in the last few years, Noah, like, obviously things have gotten crazy. Um, Shit's Creep is a phenomenon. <laughs> uh, you have, you know, been on stage in live theater you have been shooting other shows uh you released your third album you uh did this audible series you had a baby um are you hydrated i feel like you're not (laughs) sleeping enough so i'm going to skip that question Uh, what do you need what how can we help you (laughs) you know what i you know really what i want is just like a couple of weeks around the holidays where i don't have to think about anything other than like what I'm going to eat and when I'm going to bed. That's, that's, and I don't know if you can make that happen for me. I'm guessing probably not, but I feel like that's probably what mo- that's on most people's wish list. It's just like a kind of like easygoing holiday. You know, for me, it's kind of like I'm, I'm in, I'm in, uh, it's, it's my son's first Christmas and it's not like he's going to, you know, fully take it in or anything, but there's this kind of pressure to make it feel special. So I was up, hanging lights and stuff yesterday and um and that's that's kind of a good feeling and now i'm kind of ready to just settle into the uh the, the sort of pastoral winter vibes and and just kind of you know give myself over to christmas well listen i am very powerful so i am going to work on manifesting <laughs> yeah, look, a, see what a you quiet. can do yeah 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 see what you can it's, do i'm gonna i'm gonna put it out there um and <laughs> but for everybody listening, all you have to do is go to audible.ca and uh, Sleep Sound with Noah Reed is there. Uh, Audible is the best. I love it so much. And so you can get a good night's sleep. Also, real quick, Noah, I just want you to know, I just found out last week, my brother's family lives in Alaska and his eight-year-old yeah. didn't know who Franklin was. Can you oh believe that? No, that's that is that's the, there's some education to to happen right there. But I'm you know jealous of that kid. To discover Franklin would be a, would be a, dis- a an amazing discovery. That's right. Auntie is bringing Franklin the turtle right to her. Oh, and I love it. We're I getting her it. on your voice right away. <laughs> That's great. It's a, it's a lifelong journey if you go from Franklin to uh, Sleep Sound. You know, perfect, yeah. right? Well, that's what, and that's what we're doing, right. everybody. Again, go to audible.ca for Sleep Sound with Noah Reed. Noah, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Nice to chat with you guys. We will be right back on the breakdown, Channel One Sixty Seven, Canada Talks. And I'm stuck on your heart. I hang on every word you say or tear us apart Baby, I would rather be dead In your heart I see the start of every night and every day In your eyes I get lost, I get washed away Just as long as I'm here in your arms I can be in no better place You're simply the best Better than all the rest Better than anyone, anyone I've ever met. 
And I'm stuck on your heart I hang on every word you say Well, tear us apart Negro Leagues Baseball